Today we're in Long Grove, Illinois. It's about 45 degrees outside in Long Grove. Looks like they uh, are putting up the holiday decorations today for Christmas. Here's uh look like little houses. Just trying to fix my camera here. Oh. So Long Grove is a northwest suburb. End zone with the restaurante. So I think this is downtown Long Grove. We're on Archer and North Mc and Old McHenry Road. It's a little windy. This is uh, Long Grove. Everybody comes here for like strawberry picking and stuff like that. I'm sure they're used to cameras here. Look at all these. Maybe a thumbnail right there. I don't know. So, like this one's for a lease. There's the uh, chatterbox. Irish boutique. Basically everything's closed right now, but this uh, this place gets uh, crowded on Friday nights, usually when it's warm or during the holidays. I notice there's a lot of empty buildings. That's surprising. Let's check this out. Here's uh, all the stores and stuff. The map. Small Business Saturday, November 25th. 
there used to be a bridge that way um, with like a roof and stuff but I think somebody ran into it so they ain't got it no more Another empty building. Wow. Okay. There's a permit. So I think someone's moving in. So this is Long Grove, Illinois. Museum. What is that? People changing signs. 379. Wow, that's pretty cheap, I think. There's a sock monkey museum. Sock monkey crossing. So there looks like there's no coffee shops or anything over here. So no one's around. Mill Pond Shops. Long Grove Chocolates. The American flag. This will be a nice picture. Got it. Got it. Joni. Pretty cool. So we're gonna cross over here. Make sure we don't get hit by a car. So here's uh, more shops. Broken Earth Winery. Food Cafe, Highbrow, Scott's Moon. And so, here's a nice uh, statue of something. Downing. They got delivery. Real estate. I think it ends right here, so we're gonna keep on going down the street. All right, we're gonna be nice to people if they come up. Joni's Pizzeria. That's a lot of people there. That's surprising. I wonder if it's uh, the workers. So I'm wondering how well this uh, microphone is going to do with the wind. Oh, I forgot to turn it on. There we go. the annoying screens that turn on whenever someone gets gas. <coughs> and 
whatever it's called. I hope there's no wind noise. What place is this? Back porch. I'm not sure what they do. I'm not about to go on their property. Nope. Not me. Sure what this place is. Builders and remodelers. That's a weird place for builders. Within reach. This used to be an ice cream shop. Is this still ice cream shop? No, it's uh no, it looks like it's a gift shop. But uh like the last one. Oh, no, there oh, no, there's one. There's some kind of uh, restaurant down there. Epilogue. Crooked wine bar. These look like houses, but. Um, they're actually commercial. See that uh, that bridge. You'll find these statues everywhere in Illinois. This type. here studio balanced earth energy healing the hotel brave police and public safety wellness center okay not sure what that's all about looks like this is the end of long grove this way well at least the downtown part so we're in the cross. Park open. Okay, so this is park property it looks like. This is where they have some of the events here. All right. 
There's that guy, Edward Wax. Let's see who it is. All right. village tavern up there. Sighting landmark. So it's, a, it's like one of those old fashioned neighborhoods. So this is local traffic only. Oh, they rebuilt that bridge. Okay, cool, let's check it out. I thought they removed the top. Maybe they put it back on now. Fresh top on the bridge. one parking spot right there they decided we're going to build a parking spot and it's going to be that one parking spot right there <laughs> so this is long grow fashion it looks like it's uh from the 1600s or something maybe maybe that fashion is back i don't know One parking spot on this street. Oh no, there's some more up there. But, uh, here's uh, here's some more shops. Uh, candy. I got a brand name photography. Country house. It's a candy shop. Does it smell like candy? Yeah, it does smell like candy. The uh, Christmas decoration right here. Why is this guy going so slow? Country house. There's a probably like a junk store. Enough of that one. 
Okay, this this one's closed. Remodeling. This one seems to be empty as well. So you see, it seems like the economy is not as doing as well as uh, Biden saying because I mean there's there's a lot of closed shops here. I mean it's everywhere. So you'll see how this works where someone stops and then they they wait for the other guy to cross. It's only a uh, one car bridge. And historic. It smells fairly new. It's crossing a little river or a creek. It's like about 45 degrees outside. Oh boy, it's cold. I'm not prepared for this cold. So here's that long rope bridge for me. Something's in that bush over there somewhere. All right, now we're gonna go on this side. It's a fairly small city. Oh, look at that. Christmas tree's in. It looks fake. It looks way too green. This is a municipal parking lot, which means I can go to it. Cigars and more. State Farm Insurance. Not really too many restaurants around here. More like services and stuff. State Farm's getting their decorations in. BB Holiday Decorating. I wonder how profitable decorating is with a company. If you want to start yourself a decorating company, because Christmas is only like once a year. Furnishings, vintage furnishings. Yeah, I'm not sure what draws people into this town. I mean, not many places to go. Maybe that's why it's empty this morning. There's a salon and spa. Usually a salon and spa would be full. Uh, I don't see many people inside. It's hard to see, but you can see a little bit. Usually it would be like full of people. So this place is kind of empty. Maybe Long Grove is losing its charm. A couple parking spots here. I don't know if that has access to that municipal parking or not. So these look empty as well. This whole thing is empty, it looks like. 
This uh, red store is empty. I wonder why. So pretty much half the town is empty. Like this, so this place over there is empty as well. There's a fireman walking the dog. I don't know if you can see that. I know fire dogs need walking too. Okay, I'm not sure if we can go up there, but we're not going to because the sidewalk is here. But uh, looks like this place is empty. I think Long Road's got a problem. Turning into a ghost town. I mean, look at this place. It's got code violations. Looks empty. Empty as well. place it's gone All right I was not expecting this when I came here I was expecting more of you know businesses preparing for the weekend but it looks more of like just a empty desolate place there's popcorn here Signature popcorn. It's like one place that's open. We got the chatterbox. Covered Bridge Creamery. That's still open. So you got like very few places that are still open, but a lot of them, I think most, are empty. I think this is a uh, municipal parking. It's a long road historical lane. Yeah, I'm not gonna chance it, I'm not gonna go there. It looks like another empty building right here. Yep, there's a sign in the window. I don't know if they're trying to do something or... Jeez. Walking through a ghost town here. I mean, half the places look like crap. Ravelino. Not sure what that is. Got some weird shit on there. But it's closed this morning. Buildings are empty. And there's this crosswalk right here. Looks like these are done. So basically those signs on the signboard, they're begging people to come here. Because there's no one here. Like no one. And today's Friday. There's no one here. We could ask someone what's going on. Looks like they're getting remodeled or something over here. So 
if you want to help uh, Long Grove be not so empty, call this number. There's a lot of plenty of space available. It looks like a nice gazebo here. I mean, wow. I am so surprised. I'm... Last time I was here, this place was packed. You know, every Friday, there would be people walking and stuff. I, I don't know. Something's going on. Maybe people don't like old towns anymore. That's what it is. You know. They're begging people to come. here this is a very small town I'm surprised how empty it is half of the buildings or more are vacant I'm not sure why people even come here because there's really nothing here maybe a park but... all right and that's my conclusion for Long Grove Somebody lost their shoe. <laughs> I mean, that, that's the only nice thing is, <laughs> or funny about it is, somebody lost their shoe. You know, let's go this way. Maybe someone will ask me if I'm recording. You guys work for the village? Downtown. You know, it's a long road where the public works. Oh, good. <laughs> so you might be able to answer my question. Yeah. I came here to uh, record how beautiful Long Grove is, but it, it looks like a ghost town. Yeah, it's a ghost town with some, you know. I mean, more than back up. more than half of the buildings are empty. Um, I mean, last time I was here, it was like happening place, but. So we, we've gone through all the construction in the last couple of years. Yeah. And that's what's created. So we, all the streetscapes have been done. So now everyone's starting to reopen businesses. They're so reopening? Okay. It was good because we brought the city water and we brought the lights in and all the streets, sidewalks is always just getting done. And it was it was a three year project. Okay. And then COVID, so it slowed it down. So now we're finally past that point where we're starting to get a lot of interest back of, of opening. So we're getting new businesses on an annual basis. It's just. A lot of older buildings with code violations, it looks like. Uh, it's They're being remodeled as yeah. the tenants are coming in because they're doing different facades. Okay. Yeah, it would be nice to see it a uh, nice place like it used to be. It is. Before yeah, COVID. This key with all the straight, all their, uh, updates. Yeah. A nice park over there, though. That's new, it looks like. Okay. The street, the new street. All the streets are within the last three, four years. Everything's been brand new. Nice. All this right. All the old brick that's all gone. You know, it was beautiful to see, but yeah, it was just, it's a pain from a, a maintenance of, of trying to keep correct. Oh yeah, all the snow and stuff, yeah. cars sliding around. Correct. All right, well have a nice day. See Thanks. Too. So, we got our info, looks like. COVID wasn't too great for Long Grove. And uh, they're working on getting it back to where it used to be. And there you have it. That's uh, Long Grove, Illinois. All right, we'll see you on the next one.